Have you assessed yourself to have a warm skin undertone and perhaps moved on to decide that you are a true spring or true autumn or perhaps a warm spring or warm autumn? Well, this video is for you. In this video, I'm going to be covering off some key fundamentals about the warm color family and also sharing with you a picture montage from my library of people I've assessed to have a warm skin undertone and belong in one of the warm color seasons. After watching this montage, you may question whether or not you fall within the warm coloring. Stay tuned. of carolbrelly.com. Like the intro said, I'm going to be covering off some warm coloring fundamentals in this video and also sharing with you a picture montage of people who have been assessed to have a warm skin undertone and belong in one of the warm color season families. I'm so excited about sharing this series with you because it's the second in the series. If you missed my prior video uh, on cool, uh, please also refer back to that video. I'm excited to share this series with you just simply because it gives a different sort of perspective on uh, coloring because it usually is not so obvious uh, what somebody's coloring is in terms of warm versus cool. Uh, I've said in my other videos that color analysis is based on the underlying quality of your coloring and not really uh, based on skin tone. While skin tone can help guide the process, color analysis, a proper one, is based on looking at the underlying quality of your coloring by looking at you through your natural coloring and isolating your natural coloring. Uh, on the screen, I will put up a picture of how somebody should look when they are con color analyzing themselves or being color analyzed. Uh, color analysis is based on looking at one's natural coloring uh, through, uh, you know, covering uh, what they're wearing, covering their hair, no makeup on, sitting in natural daylighting, etc. Many people use their skin tone as a guide to determine their best colors and I think that can lead to a whole bunch of confusion and quite frankly can, read, can lead to uh, inaccurate color analysis results. Uh, so skin tone, which is the coloring on the outer uh, surface of your skin, can change from season to season in different environments. Uh, it can change with illness, uh, can change with pregnancy, can change if you smoke or drink alcohol. Um, what else? It can also change with uh, different medications you may be on. So it's always best to focus on your underlying quality of color. So if you're warm, uh, you'd have more yellow golden qualities to the underlying quality of your coloring. And so uh, you may have decided you have a warm skin undertone by looking at my eye pattern video where I walk you through different eye patterns that can indicate that your coloring is warm. You also may have landed here by assessing cool colors versus warm colors on you and making the decision that the warm coloring is better than the cool coloring. You also may have moved on to decide that you're a true autumn, a true spring, and you may have also then uh, moved on to decide you're a warm autumn or warm spring. This is the flow season that sits on the warm color family. What I would love to share with you in this video is that so many of my in-person and virtual coloranalysis.com clients are completely shocked when they hear they have a warm skin undertone uh, because perhaps they have blue veins. I've seen uh, so many warm people who have blue veins around their wrist. I'm not a fan of the vein test like I've said in my other videos. Uh, many warm 
brown people also uh, think that they cannot have pale skin tone and that again is a symptom of looking at your skin tone versus looking at the underlying quality to uh, your coloring as you'll see in the picture mo montage so many people in there actually have pale skin so uh, that's a skin tone thing again so now we're ready to move into the very fun part of this video which is sharing with you the picture montage of people I've assessed and as a warm skin undertone, and these pictures are from my own personal library, so please uh, don't reuse them. They are copyrighted, uh, so I'm just sharing them with you to help you uh, put a picture to sort of the warm color season family, and after viewing this montage, it isn't so obvious. The people in this library of photos gonna be coming on your screen are taken in different lighting conditions. I also may repeat one or two people in the montage so that you see them um, in different times of the year, uh, perhaps with a different skin tone, different lighting conditions, etc. Uh, and like I said, it isn't so obvious. So now let's move into the very fun montage. Everybody that you just saw on your screen are definitely in the warm undertone and warm color season families, one of them. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please comment below, like, share, subscribe.